An elderly couple found in deplorable conditions and the relative who was supposed to be taking care of them was arrested for failing to do so. The Tulsa County Sheriff's Office says what started off as a stolen car case turned into something they never saw coming. Fox 23's Paris Rain shares what deputies found in that home where the couple happened to have been neglected. Take a look at your screen. These are the photos the Tulsa County Sheriff's Office shared with me of what the elderly couple in their 60s had to live in and with for years. Uh, evening shift patrol uh, had come into contact with a stolen vehicle at this particular residence. The evening shift deputies had an opportunity to make entry into the home. Uh, they observed the extremely filthy conditions uh, of the residence. Deputy Richie Gonzalez says he was then contacted since he's the elder care deputy who provides investigations on this exact thing. The sanitation of the environment is concerning as well as if they appeared malnourished, particularly the male, was appeared extremely malnourished. Uh, I was advised of multiple medical issues that he had, as well as the other elderly resident there, a female, was telling me about multiple uh, medical issues that she was experiencing as well. TCSO says this man, Anthony Wakeman, was their relative and the assigned caretaker. But when deputies arrived, the living conditions spoke a thousand words. Deputy Gonzalez says the home was filthy and filled with trash and roaches. I had enough probable cause there in front of me affect an arrest of the individual uh, on site. That's what happened. Fortunately, you know, the, the female wanted uh, medical treatment, wanted to be checked out medically. So did the, the male subject. So both of them were transported to a local hospital for uh, medical evaluation and treatment. How often do you see something like this? I see it quite a bit, ma'am, in my capacity as the as being just the elder care deputy to provide services for the for the elderly citizens. I, I see it a lot. And how does that make you feel? Heartbroken. Deputy Gonzalez says many elders have caretakers, and a lot of the time they are family members. This incident is an example of family needing to check on one another. My message would be Please check on your loved ones. If you have loved ones, check on them. If someone's supposed to be caring for them, just don't take that for granted that that's being done. Uh, stay engaged, stay involved. And also too, if you're gonna be in the role of, of the caretaker, take that very seriously. Covering news that matters, Paris Rain, Fox 23 News.